Wow. I am not going to be looking into any funhouse mirrors anytime soon. Us is directed by Jordan Peele and starring Lupita Nyong'o, Winston Duke, Elizabeth Moss, Tim Heidecker, Shahadi Wright Joseph, and Evan Alex. Before I go any further, I just want to say there will not be any plot spoilers in this review, and I think that that is very important. This film is centered around the Wilson family, whose patriarch and matriarch are portrayed by Winston Duke and Lupita Nyong'o, and they are on a family vacation in Santa Cruz, California. And the one thing that the rest of the family doesn't know is that the Lupita Nyong'o character had a traumatic experience at a specific beach when she was a child, and her past is now coming back to haunt her in the form of a doppelganger family that just randomly show up at their house, and then the film's weirdness takes over. This is Jordan Peele's follow-up film to his breakout film in Get Out, which came out two years ago, which he won an Academy Award for for Best Original Screenplay, and this film is rather similar to that film in the sense that it is playing within the horror genre, but doing things in a very interesting and unique way. Jordan Peele is taking a lot of influence and a lot of relevance from classic horror films, as well as the classic television series The Twilight Zone, and meshing all of those things into one and coming up with one of the most unique and I would say original products of the year so far. Original in the sense that it's his vision, it's his message that is being portrayed throughout this movie, and no one else is really doing what he is doing right now within the horror genre. And that is really fascinating to me. He is taking it in a rather interesting direction, in a rather art house, in a rather expressive auteur direction that we don't get to see a lot from the horror genre. The horror genre particularly is an entertainment genre for the most part, and this film is dealing with so many different themes that you really need to take your time and be very patient with the movie and unbox a lot of them. And I'm going to be honest with you, there's going to be some things that you're not going to notice while watching it for a first time. You're probably going to have to watch this film more than once, and that really all depends on how much you like it the first time you watch it. I loved this movie for the most part to the point where I will be watching it again and again like I did with Get Out because there is so much to unravel. And some of those themes I find to be very, very fascinating. He is commenting on a lot of social issues that are happening today but not kind of big, gigantic ones, but more kind of micro ones when it comes to the relationship between people who are on different sides of an issue or are on different mindsets and just the fear and aggression and the anger that exists between the two. But what they don't really understand is that those people who are on opposite sides of the spectrum, like the doppelgangers and our protagonists are in this film in the Wilson family is that they are a lot closer to their doppelgangers than they think they are. The fear that they have is very real and very interesting because that fear Fear is almost personified within the doppelganger characters, but that fear is so personal to us that it really is who we are to a certain extent. We may not like those aspects of us, but they are what make us who we are. It is a very fascinating and very layered film from that perspective. From a technical perspective, I think the film is also extremely well made. Jordan Peele knows how to construct a film. He knows how to construct certain shots. His framing is fantastic. And his use of music throughout this film is amazing as well. The score in this film is very haunting and just creepy and eerie to the point where I find myself thinking about it when I'm home alone at night in the dark and the score will all of a sudden start playing in my head a certain chord and I'll get creeped out from it. That is the uniqueness of this film is that it can kind of get inside of you if you let it. But some of the negatives I will say with this film is that it is a very basic plot for the most part on just the surface. 
certain setups, certain scenes, the way the scares are done, and all of those things are things we've seen within the genre before, so if you are someone who's well experienced with horror films, it's not going to be surprising to you in any way from the general surface plot level. Like I said, this film is meant to be looked at about everything that's underneath the surface. That is where the heart and the gold in this film can be found. I also want to say that Lupita Nyong'o is the star of this film. She is absolutely amazing in what she has to do. The acting overall, in my opinion, I think is fantastic. She is just the standout. Winston Duke is incredible and funny in this film. The film has a lot of humor within it. A lot more humor than I thought it was going to have, but it is this kind of dark humor, this kind of unexpected humor that kind of lightens things a little bit. For some people who don't like comedy in their horror films because they would like to take everything very, very seriously, that's probably going to be a negative for you. The child actors in this film, I think, are absolutely fantastic as well. When you get actors who are playing not only their main characters, but also their opposite of their main characters. That is when you see a lot of acting talent really shine, and it shines brightly in this film. So with all that being said, I'm going to give this film a 4 out of 5 stars. It is a really great, thought-provoking, well-made, well-acted film. The surface-level plot may be a little generic for those of you who are well-experienced with horror films, but please give this film a chance and think about this film. Think about what it's trying to say and just, you know, unpackage it as much as you can on a first watch. Go back for a second if you need to. So that has been my review of Us. If you like this video, please check out the other videos on my channel.